So I wanted to take some of this channel in kind of a different direction. Hey there Ramblers, welcome back to the channel if this is your first time, hello there friend. Right now I'm out here grilling, I got the grill going. And if you've watched my channel, you've seen that I've grilled out a number of times. Um, something I like to do, um, doing it at night because it's way too hot right now here in Texas. But I wanted to start doing a series of like top X things that you should have if you're trying to learn how to cook or start cooking for yourself. There are gonna be some basics that we usually keep in our house and it's a good idea if you just start keeping around, you'll be amazed at what you can throw together. The first thing is if you're going to cook, you're gonna need something to cook on and to cook with. So number five, on like the top five things you're gonna need to either cook on or cook with is going to be a set of pots and pans. And you can be really basic. Get one big pot, one small pot, one big pan. If you wanna go fancy, you get one small pan. But one big pot, one small pot with lids, and then one frying pan. That's going to be your pot and pan set that you don't need more than that, but you can go more if they come in sets. You can get them for pretty cheap. And then you're gonna need a couple of utensils. May I suggest several spatulas, the kind that you would put underneath a steak to flip, and the kind that you would use to get all of the cookie dough out of the bowl. So there's soft spatulas, and then there's the spatulas you use for cooking in a frying pan. You're gonna need at least one of both. You're gonna need a spoon and a slotted spoon. So one that's not slotted and one that does have slots, and then a pair of tongs. You down south like I am, I'm going to suggest you get a grill. You can go get a tiny little bitty one that doesn't stand up tall, that you can put on your patio in your apartment for like $35. Grilling is the best. So if you're gonna get into cooking, definitely go get one of those little grills. Charcoal or propane, number two. Get a decent plate set. You can get, again, really cheap. They can be plastic even, but get at least four plates, bowls, cups, and, a, and then number one is a set of utensils to eat with. Spoon, fork, knife, and something to cut with. Steak knives. Make sure it has those steak knives in it. That is a key pro tip. These are gonna be the basic things that are going to be able to allow you to make most meals. So, number five, pot and pan set. Number four, utensils to cook with. Number three, a grill, especially if you live in the South. Number two, a set of four dishes, plates, bowls, cup, at the minimum four. And then number one is going to be cutlery. You want to have fork, knife, spoon, and a steak knife. And you want to have at least four of each of those. Hey, it's me from the future. I just wanted to say one thing about this video. And this video is based off assuming that you already have one knife to cut with, one chopping knife. Okay, bye. Now you're ready to actually start cooking something. So in the next set of this, I guess, little mini series that I'm gonna do, I will tell you what else that you will need to start stocking in your pantry, in your refrigerator, things like that, that are going to be easy for you to throw together a meal on the fly. You'll be surprised at what you can do. But that's going to be it for this video. I'm trying to keep them short and sweet. Do me a favor, go down there, like and subscribe, ring the notification bell for me, so well, you don't miss any of the videos that we post. Thanks for watching. Remember, life's not about the destination, it's about the journey. Okay, I want to make an addendum to the previous video one that you just watched, if you can't get a grill, at least get a crock pot. They're about the same amount of money 
and they're about the same and ease to use. So grill or crock pot. And as a bonus, a sixth, either a sixth cookware or utensil that you could get would be a couple of baking sheets, either a baking sheet for just flat one for like cookies and stuff like that, or you can get one with the sides on it. Sometimes they come in sets, so if you're already buying pot and pan set, you may actually get these as part of the set itself, which again is a nice bonus. Okay, peace.